Welcome back to Fox 54 everyone. You are taking a look over downtown Augusta here at 6 p.m. this evening. Let's go ahead and put it into motion because we had a beautiful sunset with that shelf cloud moving in and we're seeing those storms in the area for this evening. Now temperatures are currently in the 70s, 74 in Thompson, 74 in Swainsboro and 73 in Waynesboro as well. Relative humidity bumping up as we head into the rest of this evening and especially with with those showers in the area. 98% in Louisville, 92% in Aiken. Looks like Evans is going to be our driest area at 81% right now. Now current Doppler radar, we're taking it over to Washington, Thompson and Sparta. We're seeing lots of thunderstorms and lots of heavy rain in that area. So just keep an eye out for that for this evening and it's going to be moving to the northeast here and also towards the Waynesboro area in Hepzibah. So they're also seeing that right now and it's also moving out of the area, but it looks like we're going to have scattered thunderstorms throughout the rest of this evening as well. Now tonight, a low of 68 degrees, mostly cloudy skies and thunderstorms are still in the area. 60% chance of precipitation across the region. Tomorrow, a forecast high of 85 degrees. Another rainy day here. 50% chance of precipitation. Just a cloudy morning. And then as we head into the evening, those isolated thunderstorms will start to pop up in the area as well. And tomorrow is peak hurricane season, September 10th. We do have a tropical update for you towards the Gulf. It's looking favorable right now. We're not seeing any formations going on over there. We're still watching Hurricane Lee over towards the east. It just missed the Virgin Islands and it's making its way up to cooler water. So that is a good sign moving forward. Another tropical update. We we got Tropical Storm Margo making its way to the west. This is one we're going to want to keep monitoring, but projections are showing it to move to the north and be become uh, into a hurricane. So we're going to really watch this one as it turns into a hurricane by Monday. Now here's our little formation patches that we're going to be watching in the next seven days, about a 30% chance of formation there. Severe storm outlook. We are in the marginal category here in the CSR and it's going to remain that way until Monday. So storms are much more likely in the area and then we're going to see um, them move out to the coast. So that is a good sign for Thursday and Friday next week. We're going to go ahead and put our future cast into motion. We got a couple of pop up showers here this evening and a couple of heavier thunderstorms up towards Washington and McCormick. Now as we head into tomorrow, we're going to be seeing just a cloudy morning here in the CSRA. Then as we head into the evening, that's when those pop up showers start to come back into the area. You can see them start to trickle into the region. Rainfall out outlook is looking good right now. We're not expecting too much rainfall here in the next seven days. Sunday is going to be our heaviest chance of rain, but moving into Wednesday, that's going to be our last day that we're going to be seeing lots of rain. Thursday, Friday and Saturday, very low rain chances here, so that's that's going to be more fall like conditions moving forward. 10% chance of precipitation Thursday through Saturday. These are going to be our fall like temperatures in the 80s. Now go ahead and take a look at Sunday and Monday. These are going to be our thunderstorm days and then it turns into rain showers for Tuesday and Wednesday and just it looks like all of the temperatures are starting to drop as we move into this season. So here's a full look at your seven day forecast and we'll see you tomorrow here at 10.